dreams really come true. Hey, this is my second take. Every time I'm taking videos and stuff in my car, everybody wants to come by. I didn't have like three people come by during the last video just to tell me my car's nice. I appreciate it. But like, when somebody's videoing, making a blog and stuff, like, I don't know, I just thought it was real. But, I mean, I like fans and all that stuff, but there's a time and a place, I believe. But, hey, dreams come true. Dreams really come true. 2014, 2015, 2016, I didn't think I'd be here. But that's another story. Send me 
more 22s to replace the ones that I had that the paint had started flaking on. Yeah, they admitted that they had an issue. That was pretty cool about the warranty and all that stuff. I'm just waiting for them to come in. They said it would take about two months because they're coming fresh. They're not gonna be like sitting in the warehouse or anything, they're being built. So on that, that's a plus. Um, so I'm gonna keep wrapping up Ferrados. Other than that, I plan on putting my JL um, 13W7s in it. I got two of them. Looking at a different amp. Uh, the amp I had in uh, when I had the system in a different car, it pretty much maxed out. I ended up blowing, I mean, burning up one amp because it overheated. And it's had a cold chill. But um, then I had it replaced. It was like a little cheap amp, it was like $250. And then, uh, because it was under warranty, got it replaced. And then, I just don't want to go through that issue again because um, it's, it's not rated for that. Those, the own freight and everything. So, I'm not going to risk it. But, um, I just wanted to do a quick video. I haven't done a video in a while. And I just want to let everybody know what was going on and everything. Um, I did do a video showing, like, the interior already. But, uh, I mean... Don't remember. I got the diamond stitched and all that stuff, plus the, the gold pin striping and stuff like that done to it. Um, got a couple of things that I got coming in the works. So, uh, also, I got some, uh, I was gonna say, charger going down the side, a uh, vinyl, and then it's gonna have my, also, I got a couple of things with my. Instagram and YouTube names on so y'all can look me up um, Y'all see me y'all know it's me and um, It's just a working process. I mean, I got a lot of things I want to do to it I just not really in a rush because I'm still doing the motorcycle thing. I got this I mean I got a lot of toys so And everything's in project mode because it's always in project mode. I'm a car guy. I'm a motorcycle guy, you know I'm a dirt bike guy, so everything always is a project. Never gets finished. But um, today, I treated my car uh, with the shine armor. Oh man, and do y'all see it? I mean, it's really reflect. I can't even take pictures of it because I see reflections and lights and stuff flashing off of it and all that stuff. But shine armor. Hey, if you don't use shine armor, I really suggest it. It's kind of expensive. I mean, I bought three bottles and they're like $19 or $16 when you bundle. But um, I end up using about a bottle for the first application and everything. I kept the rag that I was using, so it stays in the rag. So next time when I apply it, I use that same rag where I won't use a lot of it again because um, the microfiber cloth I have, it's like a $20 microfiber cloth and it really soaks the wax up. But once you get it full with the wax, and you like keep using over and over, it really makes it uh, coat a lot better. But uh, it was a brand new fresh one that I had pulled out because I was using a different chemical, so I didn't wanna mix the chemicals and all that stuff. Um, so yeah, shine armor, shine armor. I'm gonna cut it out. All right.